There's a lot of work to do. This bridge carries 20,000 vehicles a day across the Mississippi River, linking 3rd Avenue in downtown with Central Avenue in Northeast Minneapolis. On January 4th, it'll close down for two years as part of a $130 million renovation project. We know it's an inconvenience uh, to have that bridge closed for, for as long as it's going to be closed. Uh, but we do need to take care of it. Definitely, it's 102 years old. It definitely needs some work. You heard MnDOT's David Aikens right. The 3rd Avenue Bridge was built in 1918. The steel-reinforced concrete rib arches were a relatively new thing at the time, and the S-curve gave the bridge more character than most. The S-curve is what makes it historic. It was put on the National Registry in 71. We're working with our own historians to ensure that the, the history and the look of this bridge is maintained as we fix it. Contractors will be replacing the bridge decking, restoring side rails to the original look, and creating distinct biking and pedestrian paths across the span. That'll make it safer, uh, so people, bikers and walkers, will have their own separate path. It's true the detours will be a hassle for those who rely on the 3rd Avenue Bridge, but the finished product will last quite a while. This project is going to give us another 50 years on this bridge. This is happening as part of an ongoing effort to rebuild or replace aging bridges across the state of Minnesota, something that's been happening at an accelerated pace since the collapse of the 35W Bridge 13 years ago. In Minneapolis, John Crowman, Care 11 News.